boss, why aren't there more senior women in the property industry and, and just generally industry as a whole? I think it's a fact that um, the the whole game has changed for women and men and there's a little sort of embracing the idea that um, women have got special gifts but this level of uh, political correctness, me too, has gone a little bit too far when men are starting to be a little bit afraid of women rather than embracing, thank you, embracing what they bring to the table which are special skills. We all know that women can uh, multitask better than men fantastic managers i've dealt with some amazing women solicitors um, i love dealing with women because they bring another idea actually they can look further than than we can do you agree with that yes i can and my best bosses have been women there we are uh, and and i've had some fantastic women that i've worked yeah. with on different levels um, so, but what's yeah. holding them back? Because I mean, especially in my business of a state agency, um, there's a lot of uh, females that are on the lower, you know, the bottom run of the of the ladder. Um, but then, for some reason, when you go to the more branch managers and area managers and divisional directors, yeah. you know, they they fall off by the wayside. Is it because they're looking after children? Is that a lack of confidence? Is it's it... that they're getting in their own way, like everyone else in life. You know, quite often it's not other things; it's themselves. You have to look at yourself and say, if you're a woman, you know, stop worrying about certain things. Have your femininity. Be pleased to be. Don't need to say, right, I'm the same as you. You're not the same. Men and women are different, um, but connected, as is everyone in the world. For everyone to say, right, we are now going to be, you know, one sort of ideology doesn't work so within the footprint of the model of empowerment you have to allow people to be different and grow at their own levels does that mean that we have to as bosses look instead of worrying about our weaknesses play in our strengths weakness is a strength as well because when you have a weakness um, you can utilize that and I mean Roger Federer had a lousy backhand for a long time, in my opinion, to the level. Jimmy Connors going back, service was, was not great. And yet these are guys that won tournaments. Tiger Woods, look at that, mm -hmm. coming back. He had to go through injury, had to go through psychological, all sorts of things to overcome situations. And I know that on a personal level. I was a guy that earned £15,000, which is £75,000 in my best day. Now that's, you know, the top. You can't get higher than that. Billionaire mindset was instilled. But I also got myself in a situation where I was, at another point, sleeping on the floor and had no access to money at all. I was wiped out. So you've got to look at things in a more flexible, open-minded approach. I hope that answers the question a little bit. Thank you very much.